So let's do some basic package management on an Ubuntu system using Debian packaging. We're going to use the high level utilities which understand dependencies, app cache and app git. So first let's look for all packages that contain the string wget2. So we do that with app cache search wget2 and it comes up with wget2 and wget2dev. This is uh, an enhancement to the standard wget utility which is used for recursive downloading of the content of a website or some other kinds of uh, resources. So let's just try and install. So do sudo apt get install wget2-dev and it's telling me it also needs to install w, live wget0 and wget2. It shouldn't be that surprising that you need to install the base packages on which the development package is built on. And it will download 264 kilobytes of archives, but once everything's installed, it will expand out to 805 kilobytes. So let's just say yes. I'll type Y. And it quickly goes ahead and does all that. Now suppose I want to remove wget2dev. Well, more interesting, let's try to remove wget uh, itself. So what is it doing? Oh, I shouldn't have removed wget. I meant wget2. wget I do not want to remove, so I'll type it again with the 2. And you see it wants to remove wget to dev as well because without wget, wget to dev doesn't have much meaning. Okay, and we no longer need the live wget zero. Um, it's sort of orphaned out, but we'll leave it there for now. So I'll just say yes. And I have removed things from my system. So that's the most basic operations you would need to do on an Ubuntu system using Debian packaging.